All right, so inside the 20 BHS right now, and I uh, wanted to show you one modification here that I, I felt like it was just a waste of space, and that's this area right above the uh, the fridge. So, uh, and speaking of which, I actually added this on here because when you're adjusting this, it's I think it's one through five, and I couldn't I didn't know what is one the coldest or whatever, and so I looked it up in the manual, and and so five is the coldest, so I just put that there so that way I'll. I'll always know that, so um, that might be helpful for you as well. But aside from that, uh, the video here is just for letting you guys know that it is a bunch of wasted space up here, and uh, if you want to be able to utilize it like I did, it's not that difficult to do. And um, so I added in a, uh, you know, I, I ended up ordering some parts from Forest River and got, this is just my piece of three quarter inch, um, uh, you know, finished grade uh, plywood. And then I just got, they have this face on it is basically just like a peel and stick uh, material. And so I just cut it to that size and just, you know, peel, peeled it and, and just stuck it on. And, and it's the exact same stuff as everywhere else. So it, it totally looks like it's a, a factory finish. And um, I also was able to order this from them as well which is just the edge banding that matches the edge banding and the rest of the uh, the Ibex. So, um, and then same thing here with the handles, you can get those, the hinges, and then, uh, you know, even this thing here that, that helps, uh, you know, keep it up. Um, I, I can't remember what it is offhand, but, but so I figured, all right, well, let's see if we can utilize the space, and I did. So I had some more, it doesn't already have, I don't believe it had a shut, no, it didn't have anything here. I think it was just open. So again, I just took that finished grade three quarter inch plywood um, that I have and um, and I just cut that to size. I put in some support, of course, not that difficult. And then I figured for the time being anyway, let's just go ahead and use it for, um, you know, for storing the, the hose, you know, associated with the vacuum and then the, you know, the vacuum parts um, and, and some uh, extra uh, uh, vacuum bags I had bought too. So, and you can see that's the very back and it really wasn't that difficult um, and it's just a nice thing to be able to have for some extra storage so hope you find that useful